All right, you're unmuted. Because it's oh, not pre-recorded. We're live. Psych, <laughs> jinx, buy me a Coke. Pew, 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 whatever. That was interesting. Uh, <laughs> but everybody, you got 30 minutes to fill out those answers and email them to K-Pro. So. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> You, hey, hey, I thought the other ones were way too easy, and you made these very hard. So, in a way, it's good. Uh, um, yes, and I just have enjoyed you guys so much tonight. <laughs> I am sorry. I saw this so different. Oh, um, <laughs> um, I thought this was going to be really So, you cute. guys see the red circles? Pick a number and email it to K-Pro. <laughs> she'll let you know if you won or not. <laughs> Yeah, was, oh my god! I like some of those oh. questions though, but some of them I was like, "Wow, I could have." I mean, I have the book, and I wouldn't have been able to know. I didn't know what street he crossed to go to the, you know, to the other side or whatever that was. Oh my goodness! Okay, I have to shut off my computer. My <laughs> okay, I. You know what? Even if it was hard or wasn't hard, everyone was out from like question one. <laughs> what? No, somebody's guys... gonna answer you. That is true. I'm gonna have my email up, but wow. Um, this was, <laughs> yeah. Uh, hey, email K-Pro. I mean, you, if you're the only email she gets, you're going to win by default. So even if you only have a couple answers, email it to her and just say you don't know God. any other ones. Uh, yeah. Can you like make this littler and make us bigger? And let's talk about force fed and all the secret hints and stuff or something. I don't, I don't know. Um, um, <laughs> this is how um, most and, people feel with the clues in the poem too. Just as confused. So um, I just. You know what? I sent literally, I took my kids um, out and they were on a park and doing some crazy stuff. And I spent like four hours today building this presentation and I'm like, we're going to kill it. And I knew 30 seconds in, this is going to be just a train wreck. Well, I think most like, people don't have their books in front of them. So that's problem one. Oh. I, mean, I think you have to have the book in order to, to win this, in order to get the answers, right? Especially which page number are 18 questions from. <laughs> I was like, wow. All right. uh, you guys asked for it, though. There, two days ago, you said it was too <laughs> easy, the questions that I get. It just, I'm sorry. I got the huge case of the giggles. Slap I just wants to know what the prize is. <clears throat> a million dollars. What? Yeah, that gets right? No, it's a poker chip. We're still trying to figure just this poker out. Chip. Yeah, um, just a poker chip. Nothing crazy. So the, so, uh -oh. um, yeah, we said that earlier on, but here's the thing. So at the beginning, the, the last one, I only did 10. Everyone asked for 20. It was too easy. Uh, there was a delay. We are still in the midst of this right now. Um, so <laughs> I can't wait for the wrong answer video. I think you um, should that, read the emails with the answers in a video, future video. Well, let's see if we get any because like Holly, Holly and Copper Dan, I thought they were going to be the two that would like, they're kind of competitive if, if I can read people's personalities, right? And they're both like, we don't have the book. I'm like, what? what? What's happening here? Well, on them. Uh, I think they mean on them. They don't have it on Yes, them, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So, so you still have have 27 minutes and you can rewind Did you get an email and... yet? Did anybody email you the answers yet? Hold on, let me see. <laughs> um <laughs> Oh man. And I have to tell you um what you guys are viewing right now, Mike, try to make us bigger, can you? Or You have to stop sharing your screen. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Um Cuz they don't Mike, need to see the countdown, do they? <laughs> Mike would no. Um, Mike was incredibly go. bored and he was like doing this and I am looking at the chat and there's tears coming down my eyes. We saw this as a very different experience. Mike. <laughs> I'm, I'm so sorry. I just want to apologize. The man in the park, did you email K-Pro? <clears throat> She'll let you know if, if you sent her the email. Did I get if any only right? The thrill of the chase was in an audio book, but it's not, right? Hey, he should do an audio book where Forrest actually oh, writes it. Been there, asked that. And he won't do it. Uh, okay. As soon as the numbers are involved, I'm out. <laughs> Give me words. And, okay. Um, no, I don't have any emails up to. Well, let me. No. I don't. So if you've emailed me, I, let me go to my spam folder because that's always the yeah, important thing to do. Uh, <laughs> Oh, man, I just want to thank everyone for tonight, because all it was was a fun thing for me to do, which was laugh until I absolutely cried. That was, I mean, I have not cried like that with laughter in a long, long so time. So there's a grand adventure going on. You might find those puzzles a little easier than these questions that Kate Pro came up with. That's at cowlasers.com. Check out 
click on Treasure Hunt's Grand Adventure. Four coins well, are being, give, being given away. <laughs> um, so I do need you. Okay, I just oh, I just got my first. Uh -oh. oh, I don't even know what to do now. <laughs> I think they should win just for submitting something. It might just um, be this a picture of this. Oh my god, <laughs> that'd be pretty funny. <laughs> um, Thumbs oh, up for the effort. That's right. We I, had some you know fun. What? We had some laughs. <laughs> okay, so um, and I do have to say, where are we at? We're at twenty six. We have twenty six more minutes. Yeah. So if we start talking about a topic, I think the twenty six. 20 blah, 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 will just fly by um and i every time one comes in i am going to note how quickly um let's see joel does that um, mean you emailed already she said check your spam folder so maybe you do have an email. wait who joel lewicki uh no we're good there we're good there <laughs> oh, okay okay, okay. Uh -huh. will you accept washing machine for the helicopter question oh see he meant skippy's helicopter Wait, was that a helicopter? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. See, I, oh my God, people Joel. go different ways. <laughs> what, he send you a uh, little picture, did he? No picture, but I, I really like your answers, and I haven't gotten through them all. <laughs> uh, great them on the, That's why we're staying live. At first, we were going to pre-record this and then go live, but I figured let's just stay live. Oh, Tra train wreck you know trivia. What? <laughs> maybe, maybe there should be funniest answer because <laughs> I... I, actually, he's gotten a few of these right, but some of these, oh, man. Who are you grading? Okay. Who sent it? <laughs> no, you just... don't want to say? Okay. No, you said, Joe Lewicki said, check oh, your Oh, yeah, so over. he sent an email? Okay. He probably <laughs> Grading on air, maybe. Um, okay, Mr. Lawyer, I am nah, glad. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay, so, um, but we do have, um, you know what? We have <laughs> nice. 26 more minutes. What? Oh, what? It what? Said, screenshot time? me giving the finger and make a T-shirt out of it. <laughs> oh, I like that. Um, no. Okay, I think there is still. I mean, we we have what? Actually, that's pretty impressive. The only um, thing that would have made that better is if we made a drinking game out of it. So for every question you get wrong, you got to take a shot or something. Somehow we make a drinking game out of that. That was fun. The questions were hard, but you know it was fun. <laughs> What does not applicable mean as an answer? I love these answers. I I want to, I'm giving Joel something just for answering. Ah. Um, okay. well, hey, you still guys have like 22 minutes to send in an email, so. Oh, good time. <laughs> okay. Grading on the force fen learning curve. <laughs> Okay, actually, we, we have someone to beat at this point, and it's a million dollars and a personal sit down <laughs> with Forrest Fan that will tell you where Warm Waters Hall. Yeah. Did we tell you what? The... Okay, so as we wait for additional ones to uh -oh. come in. I don't know what Mosaic Mind put, but you got a timeout by Copper Dan. It's all right, Dan. At, at this point, we're all just having fun. It's all right. No, you never know what was yeah, actually. I don't know what was said, You know what? But... For those of you that don't know, today is the first full, the for, first day of the full moon, um, and very rarely do I have to ban on Thor, and one's already been banned, and one's a coming, um, and so they're lighting up, so I will say tonight's an honorary night, so I say bring it. That's I why say bring. I'm going to hit the strip tonight, that's right. What, oh, you're going to hit the strip club? Uh, what yeah, did you say? Yeah, the strip. About a thousand. Well, see, he, now I'm reading the answers. I don't remember what the questions were. I'd have to go back and check it. K Pro's the one who knows. Oh, yeah. Wait, he sent, what he sent is, it, what's no, happening no. here? He sent me the same email that he sent to you. Oh, but I don't okay. remember. I don't have the que the answers. Hey, I don't have the did, questions memorized. So don't send them did. to me because I'm not going to know. I I actually um question um how how is this going, um Josh. Run away, <laughs> run away. If mm. um, When we talk about things that go well and things go differently than planned, these are called, okay, this is what I tell my employees. When we have what we call a failure in some people's minds is called a learning opportunity. We have had a learning opportunity. <laughs> We've had a learning opportunity and I appreciate everyone. And um, Mike, the everything oh, froze up. The, the PowerPoint froze up. So I don't know how many more minutes we have. Well, nobody can see the PowerPoint because you. Well, share, I can. So, so oh, what, okay. when do we? Well, all right, when let's, do... let's call it twenty minutes. So right now it okay, is six. Right at, it's okay, six right thirty-nine p.m. So yes, yeah, seven p.m. Pacific, 
10 p.m. Yeah. Eastern is okay. when we'll we cut off the winner. emails. You can't email after that. Right now, you can email KPro <clears throat> anything you want so for the next 20 minutes, and she won't get mad. So there you go. Oh. <laughs> okay, and actually, the full moon lasts a technical one. Oh, Sozo rocks. I love you. I'm not even going to read the rest. Um, okay, so something's in the air or something's in the water tonight, and I will say it's just kind of honoring. So let's all be honoring together. What do we want to talk about? Oh, let's do like a Friday Fandango. What is it? Saturday... Um, the word Stockton. sex, to Joel Lewicki's knowledge, does not appear in the thrill of the chase. Are you saying it does? Because I didn't know it was there either. Yeah? Well, it must be. Or the answer isn't zero, is it? <laughs> oh, maybe it is. I did a little trick question. The answer could be zero. I don't oh, know. no. No, no, no. It is no, in the book. No, no, no. By itself, or is it part of another word? Um, are you asking for a cheater uh, question? I'm just trying to this is what we it. had. No, but we have delays. We have issues from before. Right. We can't I'm go look here it up right now. Okay. Um, so here's the deal, Joel. Uh, somebody just pointed it out, AJ, I think, but you can use the slider on the video and go back and look at the questions again. Yes. So yeah, it's not like, um, Joel, they're gone. Hey Joel, let's do a little side bet. Do you want me, if I prove you wrong, is there something that, um, we could bet on the side that you would uh -oh. do or you, Hey, will you wear a cow costume? If I show <laughs> you exactly where the word sex is in TTOTC. Hmm. I'm looking it up right now. Oh, look it up. Look it up. <laughs> Maybe if I can find it. Okay, so let's um <clears throat> as we're waiting the next twenty minutes or probably fifteen minutes, um those of you that are really focusing on <clears throat> the trivia that was I think that was a pretty incredible trivia challenge. <laughs> and I'm glad that everybody is woohoo. <laughs> okay. Um so well, let's talk about um what questions do we have related to Forest Fen, the hunt. Where we're at, um, oh my goodness. Okay, I'm here now. I will win all the questions here on now. Okay, Iron Will, just hit rewind. There's 20 questions. Yeah. Get them to me before I... We already have one, and actually, he did minutes. decently. I will not say that he might have passed a course, um, well, but he definitely is the only one. So You don't have to get all of them right. It's whoever comes the closest, right? As I far think, as I'm concerned, you have to get one right. If I think you're the if somebody person. gets all of them right, they should get a bonus prize, but I don't know what that would be. Um, dinner with Forrest Fenn. Just go to his house. <laughs> Sorry. I was buddy. thinking a searcher shirt, but okay. Whatever you okay. want. <laughs> if you get all 20 right, you get a searcher shirt and lunch or dinner with Mike. One winner, though. Whoever wins. Whoever gets all of them in right first. Right. Yes, there you go. Um, I will wear a cow suit on the interstate with laser eyes. <laughs> mm -mm. We have that. You know what? That could be a contest. Who has the funniest relation? I'm AJ would have won cow at the World costume, Series. Yeah, event. that would be pretty good. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah. Well, and right. we saw what last time the cow, the cow um, alien socks from the last. Oh yeah, show. she said she's going to yeah. send those. Isn't that awesome? <clears throat> I told her to send yeah. you a pair too. So we'll see if they come in the mail. <laughs> we'll that see. was uh, Lindsay, I think, if I remember right. <laughs> But next year of the World Series of Fan, we're definitely Wait. doing a costume contest. <laughs> um, Iron Will, it is not over. We currently have, let's see, um, 18 minutes left. All you have to do is slide, rewind, Look and yeah. send an email to me at kpro3 at aol.com. Um, way too hard. I don't understand. Two days ago, I was told way too simple. Now it's way too hard. Right. I apologize up front. People are never um, happy. I don't, I, it was, I do have to say, though... <laughs> It was so off the mark that it wasn't like a few people grumbled a little. It was so ridiculously off the mark. It, it I, God, <laughs> nice. I was literally streaming <laughs> with, with tears. Um, so I will just apologize. And Mike said up front, oh, I don't think this is going to go well. I'm like, Mike, this is going to go so great. And, and Mike, as usual, you were right. Did anybody get the mad pops by the white cluffy thing? I don't even remember. me. What does it say? Me pops? I still don't understand that. You even told me the answer and I still don't get it. <laughs> Good times. It's a, it's a different kind of grand adventure. That's all, everybody. I uh -oh. am sorry. I just want to say. Well, my video's uh, locked up, so refresh. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, we're back. We're back. <laughs> okay. So... Uh <laughs> Yeah. So, okay. So, um, yeah, we tried something again. I don't know. Um, <laughs> um, I may have may not be wearing a cow suit right now. You don't know if Joel's not wearing one right now. Oh, hold on. 
<laughs> hold on, hold the presses. I will not say another any email. more people. Got another email. Yeah, right. yeah, and it's people. Okay, so let's Joel, see where we're. I saw the questions about ten minutes before we went live. That was the first time I saw them, so I had no input because I was like, "What?" And some of them. So yeah, some of them he I wants. We're good. He wants to distance himself from this as far as he can. <laughs> um, okay. Okay. Conspiracy. I'm I'm oh, ineligible okay. from playing in case anybody doesn't realize it. Uh, mm. hmm. Oh, good Here. times on a Saturday <clears throat> night. I wonder if Forrest Fenn actually tuned in. I sent him the link. He could be watching I'm, right now, everybody. I'm confident he has nothing better All to right. do. I got another think. email that came in. You got it too. But see, I, I don't know. I, you, yeah, <clears throat> you got to grade it because I don't know. You just, oh, this is what I do, as everyone knows from many videos. Um, this is what I do. So I will, hmm. let's see. We're at, Looks good. <laughs> oh my God. I have what? to give best answer to some of these when yeah. they don't know. I think yeah. they come up with Just the guess. most. Yeah. <laughs> um, wow, that was funny. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> okay, Mike, why don't you actually answer some questions? As <laughs> the questions of the 20 that you put up? What? No, like questions. Oh, for, okay. Did it? You don't have to super. Boots on the ground clothing said the whole thing's a hoax. <laughs> Somebody said I just took the, the room calling out answers and I came up with this and yeah, they right. That's true too. Okay. So Boots okay. on the Ground Clothing has got Treasure Hunt number two going on, everybody. So Oh my gosh. You don't know what state it's in yet, at least I don't. So it could be where you live. Go check out BOTGclothing.com. And, and if it's something. anywhere near me, I'm ready to go boots on the ground again. I'm ready to kill it. I think okay. I solved clue number one, but I'm not sure how you use it on clue number two yet. Like, I'm not sure how that works. So at some point we'll talk about it. But he's still got, there's going to be nine clues for that treasure hunt. And he's only released two so far. But to be eligible, you got to buy something. And if everybody, anybody who saw my boots on the ground video, like I said, support people who are doing treasure hunts. Support Jenny Kyle. Support um, Copper Dan who's hiding uh, tokens. You know what I mean? Support us because we're hiding the silver one. Support boots on the ground. Anybody who does a treasure hunt. Uh, you know, give them support. The more treasure hunts, the better. That's the way. I wow, think. we have somebody really close to twenty, right? And I, you know, there's yeah. people that like have just about memorized the book. I think so. It's pretty <clears throat> awesome. <laughs> the questions, Disney Dream, are in the video. You got to slide the slider back to the beginning. We showed all twenty questions in the beginning of this video, and you can go back and watch those. You still got. 13 minutes to send the answers to Capro. Capro3 at AOL.com. Wow. This one. Davio Davio's going to win this one. <laughs> Wait. Denali photos. Uh, what are the Denali uh, photos? One. Wow. Pretty okay. Close. I've only gotten two emails so far. Did you get more than that? Because you guys don't have oh, to email yeah. me. Just email yeah, Capro. No, yeah. you, no oh, you don't have to. But I don't want to see them. You guys email Capro. <clears throat> okay. Wow. There's there's some impress. Okay. I'm going to keep going. So, Mike, you got to hold. The okay. I what? emailed you your home address. Hope of oh, Joel Luigi. <laughs> Joel Luigi. Okay. I gave up after question six. Um, People uh, are way over question six. Um, I Wow. Um, okay. So I'm going to keep going. So you know what? Ask the hard-hitting questions because we're honoring enough tonight to answer. What's okay. Forrest Fenn's middle name? <laughs> People might know that. They might not. Mm. Tell K-Pro to count the kids in the windows for the full count. Oh, yeah. That's what I asked too, Joel. When I saw that one, I said, do the kids in the windows count? They should, right? <laughs> If you said in the picture, then all the kids in the picture count. Yes, and there's two answers to helicopter as well. I will take both. Okay. All right. It, it, some of these are subjective because there may be an answer Capro didn't think of that's technically correct, like the helicopter one. So, oh, my gosh. I if you put that Forrest Fenn is the assassin, I <laughs> throw you out on nice. pure bite. Okay. Burn, yeah. One question from Mike's Boots on the Ground video. Have those who create treasure hunts secured insurance in case someone dies on their hunt? Well, I don't think that's necessary. Did Forrest Fenn do that? I mean, 
I think per- people have personal responsibility. In my opinion, right. I don't think you need to do something like that for whatever the treasure hunt is. Because where I went, when I went on my boots on the ground, it was way farther than I should have. So that's on me, right? I didn't follow the clues, and they took me up there. I thought the clues did, but I was wrong. Just like people have gone certain places in the Rocky Mountains that are wrong. But at least Forrest did come out and say the chest isn't in water. But a lot of kids could be correct. <laughs> How many kids are in the picture? A lot of kids. More than several. Um, that is actually one of the answers. <laughs> A lot of kids? You wanted a number, didn't you, at least? Uh, yes. There's, and, like, the answer is, like, none, not applicable, go on to the next. I right. mean, some people are really getting fun with. Well, um, that's funny. Welcome to Fen Speak. Subjective rather than relative. And, yeah, that's kind of true, isn't it? What are the warm waters yes. at Halton? Can you dip your toe in it? I don't even know anymore. Oh, <laughs> God, let's just throw it all out there tonight. I don't let's even know just... anymore. Yeah, okay. Because no. <laughs> you know how people say 200 footer? 200 footer from what? Has anybody ever actually said from what? Is it the actual treasure chest or is it from something else? I don't know. I don't know. Can we roll the footage? Yeah, <laughs> right, right, right. Oh, goodness. Davio um, good says point, you get his email yet. Um, Davio, several times. Thank you. Oh, several times. Look out. <laughs> no, You're I'm just taking, taking the first the one. Current email. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, and it looks like the same one, but yes, I definitely got it. So I will, like, I want. Actually, there's more than <laughs> a lot of you hung in there, guys, and you still have 10 minutes. So um, why would Forrest Fenn be responsible for someone at their own free actions? That's how we're taking it. As long as we say um, <clears throat> it is not in a dangerous place, like nothing has been in a dangerous place, that's the philosophy that we're taking. Um, I, just because that's the philosophy that Forrest took. So. Right, right. I mean, I think you're, you know, people are responsible for their own deal. Um, you want to talk about the coin hunt that we just did? <laughs> no. give, them, give them the news. Give them the news. Okay. So the so... city was, uh, most people figured out the city. The city was. Yeah. Um, so this is, <laughs> oh, okay, I got to get the giggles <laughs> out of me. Um, okay, so the city was Philadelphia. Mm-hmm. Um, I did not come up with the, the, the um, puzzle hunt. For this the one, clues, the clues. Um, but Somebody yeah, I knew it. It what it was. Us, but yeah. that's fine. And so after, like within two hours, people were like, "It's already been found because we've been out there for hours." Right. It right. was hidden very well in a certain um, uh, monument or or statue. Um, but I will say that um, it after. So I had someone that I knew that went out this morning. And two people searched in the exact spot for over two hours in every little hidey hole in that particular spot. Some people that said, this is the spot that I'm in and it's been found, they weren't in the right spot. But a couple people were in the right spot. And so I asked this person, and thank you so much, you know who you are, for going out. (laughs) And um, It was a family day today and they took part of their family out and said, can you just help me out? Because I really wanted to put it at rest the item is not out there but it has not been turned in as as a found item so um i will say so several people had said it and the person that went out there said hey if i've had to go on out here you got to put another one in philly um (laughs) the people that put it in philly are not residents of philly so i will try to figure out a way over the next 35 40 that go out there yes mike well, that's the. I was just going to point out that one. That's why we use a proxy item because what if somebody found yes. the proxy item that doesn't know who we are, doesn't know about silver coins? They just found, hey, what's this thing in this statue? That's why yeah. we use a proxy item because we still have the coin. And if nobody turns in that proxy item that does have a little code on it, then that coin will be given out in another, a different treasure hunt. Okay, we will do another yep. one for that particular coin. But the other thing is that's the same with any treasure hunt. Somebody could find it, but if they don't notify that they found it. You don't know if it's found or not. Well, it was kind of like the Forrest Fenn one. Somebody said, I went out there. I didn't find it. That means it's gone. And someone took it. And I'm like, okay, (laughs) Forrest Fenn. You could be in the wrong spot. Yeah. Yeah, And they actually were. I said, can you take a picture of it? They took a picture and they were across the street. And so I'm like, you're, you're within like 200 feet of it, but you're not close. Now it ended up a couple people, um, it was behind <laughs> the break from the National Treasure is a good movie. Yeah. yeah. Yes, it is. So, um, so I will say we'll try to get one back out there. I can't, I, I, I think it's time. Have... One thing some people have said is 
Are you going to put one in the Rockies? I can tell you there's one going in the Rockies very, very soon. But that's um, one of the four states. That could be anywhere, right? Yes, of yeah. course. But so, I am of the belief, and Mike and I disagree on this, and Mike can be wrong at least once. Um, I think we should put out, like I did with Raleigh, it's in an out, it's in a one-day drive of Raleigh. When I make up my next one, I am going to be putting the general location because I just, that's what I, I don't want to waste my time if it's in a whole different part of the country. But Mike and I disagree on that. Like, well, I will say boots on the ground clothing is said. You can figure it out from the first two clues what the general location is, so yeah. that you got to put in a little bit of work. Um, let's see. Did I Denali Photos? Did you get an email from Denali Photos at gmail.com? Yes, I sure did. Okay, so she did get your email, and we will. We're going to announce the winner here before we go off, right? In okay, and people are minutes, private messaging me over. Left. People are private messaging me over on Thor. That no, I'm work. not going to go sign in. I have to have it on my email. Um, what does that mean, Dan? You okay. couldn't hear us for a little while? I can hear you now. Yeah, I don't know what he means. I don't know what that means either. Okay. Um, so, okay. There's. Uh, so, what else are we thinking in the... Okay, so we're getting ready. We're. This is the worst of the season. We're getting ready to... To uh, anybody going to Fenbury, is there any questions from the room? Because I mean, this is like this is like Toby's Friday Fandango. Like, what are the huh. questions there are? Hold on one sec. So we do have all three. I put all three books up. On I'll be eBay. right back. Yeah. Okay. So just so you guys know, I put all three books up on eBay. Actually, these are the three books right behind me, right there. Oh, and there's some Legos. I wonder what that's for. I put up three books on eBay for ninety nine bucks. They had currently have one bid. So if you need all three books, you know. Well, there they are. I also put up one of the maps, but I don't know if that map is a Fenbury map. It doesn't say Fenbury on it, but maybe that's the original map. I'm not sure. But that's on eBay, and that's at 200 bucks. Uh, Forrest Fenn signed it, and it is number six out of 100. So that's there. And then I was thinking of putting a World Series of Fenn t-shirt up on eBay, too, and a hoodie, and then maybe one of the Searcher shirts. I just haven't done it yet, but I might do that sometime this week. Um so, yeah, that's kind of what we do is we put stuff on eBay, and if people want to buy it, they can. If they don't, well, guess what? You don't have to, and it doesn't affect your search in any way at all. Uh, and then we do these fun things like trivia, and then we're doing these free treasure hunts for silver coins. I'm back. I'm back. Well, and I don't know if I announced – I don't know what you were talking about, but I just met up with Bill, who now has a boots on the ground. He's He was able to take his – coin 47 which i just handed to him oh, yeah. he just Let's see how on much it went for. how much did it go for i'm gonna look it up i don't know it's between just... four and six hundred bucks so I, I think it was six hundred bucks for coin 47 was it yeah and I'm he did it, it right he was a little off he was actually out of the country when he started he it and oh, so it okay. ended at 4 30 a.m which was not um look at this everybody i'm gonna show this right now Coin 47 of the Forest Fen Searcher coin went for $660 on eBay. Now, just think when we start giving the uh, lower sequence numbers, when we start hiding the lower sequence numbers, number 10, number 9, number 8. <laughs> think of what those could potentially go for. These are kind of big treasure hunts, but we'll get to that. We've got all year to okay. do this. All Wait, time. what did I miss? There's a rocks is saying Toby had 170 people. We only see 56. What does that mean? Well, that's the only people that want to watch. Plus, it is Saturday night, so, you know. Well, no, I think the big one, and I'm going to be the first to say it, when we talk about other hunts or the silver hunts or the Jenny hunts or Jenny and Dow's hunts, we don't see as much. And I have not been willing until April to talk about the Forest Fen. When we talk about the Forest Fen hunt, we were up to, I think our top has been about 160. Um, and I love that Toby is back. And when he talks about anything, I mean, the droves will come. There's no question. Toby is like, I call, I, he's like the dad or the grandfather of the chase. So um, I will say that we know that when we talk about the <laughs> silver hunts or any of the, like this trivia, this is kind of a silly, fun thing. And so we kind of have the diehards and that's it. Um, but we, we've been up and about, and I want to say thank you to Mike, who has been really good about um, letting me take a little bit of a break from the discussions. I have a so many I like the oh the yeah. six questions I have so much to say about many of the different things but Mike's been really good about we'll get to it um, yeah we'll get yeah to yeah so hopefully that'll come back we'll see in April um so anyway that's that's a little bit of what's happening with us but also like many of the tubers say so many people have said this is how you're making your living and you're living off a <laughs> forest um it's not it's 
not even a dinner out. I mean, it a, a uh, month. I mean, it's just it's just not. It's just fun. So this was something fun. Um, yeah, we have a couple it, questions. So yes, go ahead, Mike. Well, Mosaic Mind says, do we have more maps? Will we have a supply of maps? So we have the official Too Far to Walk benchmark map. I have about 40 left, guys. The map is $105, and you get the 2019 silver coin. But check it out, guys. You get the coin with no number on it, okay? There's no sequence number on the back. This is not a silver coin, as in real silver. It's just silver color. It is nickel-plated, in fact. Somebody else asked, hey, the coin doesn't look silver. It looks nickel. We're just using silver in color. Okay, don't anybody think it's real silver plated because it's not. But yeah, we do have about 40 of the too far to walk maps left. So there's and no rush. <laughs> and Mosaic bucks. Mind said, okay, you to step back. So Toby and Shelly have been solid. I don't, I'm not sure if you know or if you're new, um, but Toby and Shelly step back for a little bit too. We yeah. all do. We all just need some time at different times. They step back. Oh, um, they step back, but they're back in. I don't think they ever really left, and I don't think I ever really left. There's just some certain things that I won't talk about or will talk about at this point. But I have another trivia. So, um, Mike, please take over the right. questions for me. You guys, you got about one minute to get your answers in. Kpro3 at AOL.com. Kpro3 at AOL.com. Uh, Chris Yates just asked that. So we're going to cut it off here okay. in about a minute, right? One minute left. Yes. One minute. Uh, that's one I'm trying to make. Yeah, Mosaic, it's 105. Just email me, callazars at gmail.com, and I'll send you the PayPal link, and I'll get it out in the mail to you Monday if you want to go ahead and pay for it. 105 for the benchmark Too Far to Walk map. I think what I'm going to have Copper Dan do, if he will, is uh, frame it like he did this one, frame the benchmark map, but i got to get to that down the road. I think he has some orders already for framing. He's got to get to Oh, the my goodness. We have more. Okay. Okay, uh, keep going, Mike. Rock Las Vegas, nice vid with the kids. Yeah, thanks, everybody. It was The Foots on the Ground was really fun. It was very frustrating. Um, but <laughs> Joel said, quick, make up some answers and email it to K-Pro. Uh, oh, T. Doggett says, K-Pro, did you get my email? T. Uh, Doggett, I uh, will look in just a second. Hold on. How many Ooh. emails have you got in total so far? Oh, hold on. Okay. Hold on. Right. We'll get to that, guys. We're going to go over the winner. Maybe we'll go over the correct answers. I don't know if K-Pro thought of doing that. Because um, I yeah. don't know where sex is in the Thrill of the Chase book either. But Oh, Mike. Here, let me help you with that All sex right. Thanks, conversation. Baby hustle. <laughs> hey, now. Uh, <laughs> oh, wow. No, There's... Dog it. The silver coins are not for sale. Okay, it's just so everybody knows. This was K-Pro's idea. And somehow she talked to Forrest, and he never even asked my opinion. But anyway, what? the silver what? numbered the silver numbered coins. K Pro had the idea of doing treasure hunts for silver. They're nickel people, but we're calling them silver because they look silver. Fifty numbered coins that are nickel, nickel plated, but to not sell, to not, but to do treasure hunts. Fifty different treasure hunts, and that's what we're doing. So somebody just asked, "Can I just buy one that has a number on it?" You cannot from us because we're hiding them all across the U.S. in treasure hunts. But the people who find them, like um, the one guy just put them on eBay, and it went for $660. So once you find one of these proxy items we're hiding and I send you the coin, it's yours to do with whatever you want, right? So you can't buy them for me and Capro. No, you cannot. We do have some of the nickel coins that do not have a sequence number on them. And if you go to cowlasers.com and hit the shop button, you'll see the things that we have for sale. And that if you... Uh, spend $100 or more, I believe it is, you'll get one of the silver nickel, but it's silver colored coins that do not have a sequence number on them. And those are limited edition too. So we are going to run out of those at some point. We're not making any more. So they are limited edition. But no, we are not selling the coins with the numbers on them. There are a couple of the copper that are left, which are right here, that do have sequence numbers on them. And those are on the website. The numbers that are available, those coins are $200 each and they are on the website kalazars.com and you click on the shop button kalazars you're all about making money what's so crazy uh it's not mm -hmm. all about making money it's just options it's there if you want a map we remember we bought forest fence personal map collection off of ebay well we still have some of those left somebody asked me recently how many did you sell i don't know we probably sold about 150 of those maps up to, to this date right now the maps are 25 dollars each we lowered the price any of the maps from forest fence personal collection their topographic maps are $25 each. If you order four or more, you get the silver coin without the number on it. 
So, yeah, and we have some T-shirts and some other things for sale, and there's nothing wrong with that. There's some other people on YouTube that are now selling some merchandise, and you know what I say to them? Why wouldn't you? Good luck. You know, Good go ahead. Idea. Why not monetize your YouTube channel? You're making videos. Why not sell a, a coffee cup or a T-shirt or whatever it is you want to sell? Um, or a mouse pad or whatever, yeah. I mean, Dale makes money off of the blog, right? Jetty Kyle, it, that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. These people, it's a lot of work what me and K-Pro are doing here, especially with the treasure hunts, but just to make the videos, just to come up with content. So that's why we had the idea of let's buy the books and sell them. So we have the thrill oh. of the chase and too far to walk. And once Oh, we have kind of a runoff. Oh, okay. Is there any more a questions? Or, is there uh -oh. any more? Did you come up with I... a, a question to have? A oh, no. Holy <laughs> heck. Hold on a second. Okay. We have. Okay. Hold on. We have. Let's see. One, two, three, four. No, Zozo. Everything is nickel plated. They are silver in color. Okay. Everything is nickel plated. They're not real silver. They're not real silver coins. They're not real silver plated coins. They're nickel oh plated. God. We I use the term silver just because they look silver to me. That's all. That's my all God, I think we have a tie. Mm -mm. So okay, so let's get, go through. Yeah, let's right. go through the answers and see what we think. Um, ID card. <laughs> okay, okay. So let's go through the answers and let's see. Can, can we go back to the? Oh shoot. Um, yeah, we I know, start. Mosaic, it is. But there's some people who just feel like, I don't know. There's people that feel like we owe them something, and we don't. We pick what we want to put in videos, and we pick if we want to sell something, and we don't really owe anybody. Yeah, anything, but right? you know what? I'm I'm the worst of the group, I think, with um, apologizing. I, I'm just done. Um, so <laughs> I say we go back to, I, I know that sounds terrible, and well, I don't mean apologizing it. apologizing for anything. I'm just trying to say. I know, uh, you're explaining. I'm just like, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. All like, because right, I'm bad. Okay, so time's up, and I will say um, we had about ten submissions, and let me see if anyone. Ten okay. emails. Okay. Yeah, ten emails. Let me go to my spam just to make sure there's none of my spam because I actually think there are two that are. No, no that indulgence. Looks... It's not first one. It's whoever answers the most questions. But if somebody, if two right, emails, but it's, oh, then it's whoever came in, whoever yeah, answered we could it, do it first. That way. Yeah, we could yeah, do it and that it way. did say that in the rules. So let's yeah, go over it right. because they actually <laughs> answered different ones. So okay. let me do a share screen. And for those, I'm up for tell me the wiki yeah. one. We'll never hear the end of it. <laughs> I won't say who. Um, let's see. Share screen. Do you see? Do you see that? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, Question shoot. I don't long. have my book, so you're going to have to grab your book. I don't have my book right why on. Why do me. I have to grab it? Well, I mean, why do we need the book? Well, just in case somebody questions. We'll see. Right. We'll see what well, happens. This book's in plastic, so I do have a book I can get. Yeah, here it is. No, I, I got it. I, got I can it. go grab one. I got it. I got it. Okay. So the okay, so the first question was what was Forest Fence retirement salary annually according to TTOTC? That was on page 105 and it was $12,000 a year. All right. So what so, I'll do is look them up to make sure we're right. So I'm, I'm verifying in other words. I'm the fact checker. Page 105. Okay. How much? No, oh, I'm on the wrong $12, page. $12,000 a year. 105. $12,000 a year. That's blue jeans and hush puppies. That's correct. I yep. just looked it up. Okay. Number two, what street did Forrest cross to get to the, <laughs> oh, I see. I see why some people answered. What street did Forrest Fen cross to get to the pie shop on the way to the school, according to TCOTC? I thought it was Canyon Street. Apparently, I'm wrong. It was actually First and French, um, but I said street rather than street, so I right. now understand why some people answered the way they did. So, back to that point. Uh, page 33. So... Um, so you're saying both should be right? Let's see. Yes. Um, so now I need to go back to... Um, now I need to... Oh, gosh. Some people are giving me opinions about... So I'll get to those. I promise you. I promise. Uh, right. It says, when I walked the mile to school on cold mornings, my path took me right past the pie factory on First Street in French. Right. It doesn't actually say he crossed the street to get there, though. <laughs> Does it? It oh, was, dear uh, Lord. Was, well, I'm just saying. All right. I was thinking of cross the street like I think no place for the biddies. Something about crossing the street. No, you're right. It is, I would take first street and French. Both are correct. Either or are both correct answers. Okay. Me, me, and first French. Okay. Eight, two, so that would be 11. Okay. Um, okay. So, okay. Number three. Oh, 
wrong one. So wrong Zozo computer. is asking a question. First oh, email that? with a hundred percent correct or first email with the most correct. It's the first, if somebody gets a, the first email with a hundred percent of the answers, correct. I just don't know if we have anybody that got it. Oh, no, you don't have anybody. Yeah. No. So it's the first person. So it's going to be the, the email with the most correct answers. Now, if there's yeah, a tie, that came in then first. it goes to who came in first. Yeah. Okay. And we'll see if that yeah. happens, it's a which test. we have it's two, a we have two, we have two in the hunt right now because everybody okay. else is not close in comparison to these two. All right. Question um, okay. Question three, how many times did Forrest Fan climb the ladder to his plane in Vietnam as found in TTOTC? That is 274 on page 76. Ooh, I opened it up right there. Um, umbilical. Uh, also, umbilical's in the thrill of the chase. A lot of people posted that when I did the six questions video. It was almost umbilical. Hey, are you, okay. I oh yeah, yeah. I, I didn't realize it was in the down here. I climbed the, I climbed that ladder 274 times in Vietnam, and each time I wondered if that beautiful plane would bring me home, and it did 272 times. So page 76, okay. 274 is the correct answer. Okay, so now question four: Name two pages which you see uh, red letters. Men is one of them. But when you did you uh, want page number, or could they give yeah. you a different? Uh, answer. Two pages. I wanted two different pages. Okay. Uh, like I would have said uh, stout hundred men, but that wouldn't have been right. So okay. Right. One's about Peggy, right? Well, it was page one oh nine and one eleven. Really? Mm-hmm. One oh nine. Yep, one eleven is do not touch. That's in red. And 109, oh, is do not touch. That's in red. I thought there were other places there's red, no? Mm -mm. There's green. Oh, okay. No. Well, then I got that wrong. So both mm -hmm. places it says do not touch. Now, if yeah. anybody sees something different, let me know. Um, how many school children are there in the, <laughs> in the 1936 picture? Okay, maybe this one will be controversial because I don't think I did count the, I counted, I went off Copper Dan's, like 118. Copper um, Dan. Copper Dan. Where is um, that picture? What page? That is page, what are we on? Five? Um, 18, 19. And actually, right. no one got it right. So let's make sure. What is the sure. answer? What is the answer? 100 and, 118. Which the one didn't answer that one that's in the hunt. And I see 10 kids in the in the glass in the building. But no, we're talking about the heat. Oh, te okay. Yeah. So it would be 120. But, but the other one said 111. It's, so it's, it's hard to see if it's like a ghost image or a real person. Yeah. Either both I of them went 10. under the 118. What, what are you talking about? 10. There's 118. No, no, I, I know. But just in the, you said the oh, 10 more. number from. So Copper it would Dan. need to be from 118 to 128. Yeah, so I'm not counting all these. Okay. <laughs> There's a lot of kids. A lot, and actually, several people answered a lot. Let's yeah. move on. Six. Funny. In what country did Skippy die while well, scuba diving? Cosmo, Mexico. Wait, somebody said page seventy-five has a red letter in it, and I thought there was somewhere else. Let me check. Nope, I do not see any red letters on page seventy-five. What are they talking about? Page seventy-five has a red lowercase a. No, nope. no, it doesn't. I'm looking at it right now. Okay, right. so Keep both going. of the finalists got that one right. What is the name of the helicopter referenced in TTOTC? Um, oh, I still have people. Guys, we're past time. Lots of people are turning in there. Uh, we're, we're past time. I'm sorry. Right. Uh, let's see. Yeah, some people are saying, I was late. It's all right, everybody. We're going to do this again sometime. You'll have uh, another shot. But I'm going to come up with the questions this time. Should be yeah, okay. You be in the hot seat, mister. Um, okay, so um, number, what are we on? Seven, that is on page 93. I would have actually accepted two answers, which is Jolly Green Giant and Candy Ann. Are we good, Mike? Yeah, I'm sorry. What <laughs> What page? <laughs> 73, okay. 73. Candy yeah. apple. Uh, Candy Ann. Hold on. What? What? Seven. 
Uh, 93. Uh, 90, say, not 73, 93. I would have See, actually I would have said the Jolly Green Giant, but is that a See, and I would have said Candy Ann because it's sitting on the side of the look next to the guy's head. It says Candy Ann, but right, I'll but, take either one. Yeah, yeah, because I'll it, take either one. Down here it says as is the Jolly Green gi Giant helicopter behind. Her name Oh, her name is the Candy Ann. Oh, I see. And what was the question? What is the name? Yeah, I would only take Candy Ann because it says her name is the Candy Ann. Okay. It's called a Jolly Green Giant, but her name is Candy Ann. Okay, well, if that, that. okay, I think you're going to have some upset people. That's up to you, though. One. If you want to take both. Take no, both. I mean, I had Candy Ann, but I could kind yeah. of see. Okay. And so now we'll that I see it off. says specifically her name is Candy Ann. That Anne. might change the game. Okay, so number eight, uh, name two accused assassins specifically named in. D and those of you that said Forest Fen, you ah. are now officially <laughs> banned off of the Forest Fen island of Calazar's chat room. Um, mm. No. Um, let's see. That is page 102. John Wilk Booth, Lee Harvey Oswald. John Wilkes Booth, yep, and Lee Harvey Oswald. Okay, yeah, that's them. Okay, number nine. What chapter does the illustration reside that was auctioned off at Operation and Jamie's that's Fundraiser? Dancing Gypsies, right? Around that's the fire. a Dancing Gypsies, right. yes. So that is uh, 43. Yes, page 43. That is the only one that was auctioned off at Operation Jamie. So that's the only answer. Page yep. 43. And okay. And then what year was Forrest Fenn's dad born according to TTOTC? Go to page 144. 144. Oh, all the way in the back. Well, there it is. My father, born 1903. So it's the picture, and it says right there, my father, born 1903, right there. Yeah, okay. there it is. Cool. And I tried to change up some of the wording because I know some people have digital copies, and I didn't want them to just get it automatically. Find the page of this passage. That's why I did this. Me pops was resting his <laughs> bones at the side of the white, fluffy, puffy, puffy thing chilling okay so go to page 147 and it talks about clouds i think it's on i don't know a couple couple lines in <laughs> oh I, neither of them got it right so 147 147 the very last page of the book almost oh no it's, yeah very last page no. of the book uh butterfly is really a flutter by that's not it right now I feel that my father is sitting on the edge of a cloud somewhere watching. Is that it? Yeah. So my father, me pops, is resting at his his bones at this side of the white puffy thing, which is a cloud, chilling. No one got that right. No one in the entire. I'm this shocking. No one got that right. Yeah, that was a hard one. But it's page one forty seven <laughs> was the answer. Yes. Uh, okay. Who was the family pet according to Forrest? It's not uh, really. <laughs> No, I'm <laughs> in TTOTC. Right? Willie right. did not exist in TTOTC. I know, I know. So page 40. Did anybody and the answer, answer was really? June. Yeah. No. Uh, oh, okay. No, they were going to win. So. And we are a dead yeah. heat with two, two people right there. Page 40. June never got switched. She was the family pet. That's right. Okay. Okay. Uh, number 13, which of Illinois ghosts, what's the word, can be found in the Lewis and Clark chapter in TTOTC? Well, and that can I be found know. on page 61, which is Swivet. Swivet. But Donnie got in a serious Swivet and wouldn't speak to me for a while. All right. Yeah, there you go. Um, 14, horribly worded question. I know. I'm sorry. This is me. This is why I have no chest, treasure chest. Um, what age did Forrest Fenn's dad give him a Daisy Air rifle for his birthday? Uh, 14 is on page 37, and the answer is 8. And so page that is question 14. 14. My father gave me a Daisy Air rifle for my 8th birthday, so 8, right? Yeah. Yes. Name the two major events. That took place in 1930, according to Forrest Fenn in TTOTC. I have no uh, idea. What is that? The in, so in 1930 he was born and his house was built. Oh, and that's on page 118. 118. 
you guys thought you knew the book. <laughs> Little did you know. Let's see, 15. I'm just trying to keep track to try to see who wins because we are kind of in a dead heat. So, you said number... page what? Page what? Uh, 118. That's when he talks. We know he was born in 1930, but that was when his his house was built. It says it on oh, the picture, yeah, okay. I think. Yeah, the pride of our family built in 1930, the year I was born. Okay. I got you. Okay, so number 16, which I don't think anybody got right. Um, let's see. On what page does the word sex appear in TTOTC? Go to the back cover. The there back is cover a... That? No, the back inside cover. Okay. There is a um, like military um, card, and it says sex, and he has male or M for male. But it has oh, the word sex. see, we thought you meant. In, I thought you meant in the text, sneaky. So it's his ID card. No, it's in the book, and I don't know what kind of sex you guys were thinking of. It's gender, which they said nah. sex back in that day. So I get your mind out of the back. That's guys. pretty good. That's my pretty good. My God, my God. Okay. 17, what is the poundage of the TTOTC cardstock pages? Good Please go to one. go to the last page on the inside back cover. And it says it's a 100-pound cardstock or 100-pound page poundage. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. What page? I'm getting emails about. I think people are saying there's another. Uh, whatever you sent me, it didn't come through. So, wait, 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 wait. Uh, uh, uh. You're sending me a blank email, so I don't know. Oh, wait. There we go. Oh, yeah. They did find another letter that's red. Hang on. So let me find the page. I'm page 75. Why didn't I see it when I looked? Let's go through them all. And then anybody that thinks they have more, they can tell us if they have more. And then we can see. What is sex? It's gender. Zozo rocks one. Wow. So. Well, that's interesting. Um, so in my copy of The Thrill of the Chase, the A is not red on page 75. But somebody sent me a picture where it is red. So could that be a difference between editions, maybe? Because <laughs> in my book, it is not red. I'm looking at it right now. Forrest, I think we need to get Forrest um, on the horn. What? Knowledge dons a dress of note. So this is the Courage Wears a Crimson Coat poem. And she showed me a copy where it says Knowledge Don's A, dress of note, and the A is in red. But it's not in my book. It's not red in mine. So I don't know about that one. Unless they wrote it with a red marker or something. That's cool. That's weird. Is anybody else's red? Does anybody have a thrill of the chase and can show it where it's red? Because look, this is not red at all. That's awesome. Yeah, that's weird. So, huh. Kind of kooky. It is not red in mine, says Joel Lewicki. Let me go get my, uh, what printing do you have? I have printing eight, I think. Hold on a minute. I'll be right back. Yeah, that's a good catch, Tabby. But if it's not red in ours, I don't know what to tell you. That's interesting, though. If there's a copy that where it was, the A was red. I don't think it means anything treasure chest wise. But yeah, it's not red in mine either. So joking. Okay. The question would have been would have been where can the word sex be found? What page? None. Oh, because it's not an actual page. Let's see. I don't remember what the actual question was, but the back cover would have been the answer because right here in the ID card is where it says sex male for whatever that ID card is. But again, guys, we're just having fun with some trivia questions. Uh, yeah. Well, it's not red. Trust me. So, Tabby, what edition is your book? Email me that, would you? Because uh. Yeah, it's interesting. <clears throat> my book's gone missing. Hmm. Oh, nice. Okay, I don't have my book. Okay, so um, okay, so that was seventeen. That's a good question. Let's go. Let's go, let's go to eighteen. <laughs> I want to give up. In what chapter of TTO TC do you first read? What do you expect for free admission? Um, and I have the fourth and, edition actually, and it's not read in the fourth. So go ahead. Okay, uh, page 50, My Brother Skippy, which is both of my finalists got it right. What did you expect for free admission? Yeah, that's what Skippy said about his uh, washing machine thing that he made. Yep, page 50, My Brother Being Skippy. 
Yeah, and I was so sure everybody just said no and not applicable for the sex one. Nobody answered another place. Um, how many different printings of TTOT has there been there as of today? Nine is from what I know as of today. <sighs> it's almost over, Mike. I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, I thought I was going to play poker. I don't know. Oh my God, I'm going to bed. I'm going to go take a long bath after this. Okay, so um, one got it right, one didn't. Okay, and so um, add the page numbers to where you found these answers of the trivia questions. And the answer would have been uh, 415, which is 105 plus 33 plus 76 plus 57 plus 144. And the answer is what's the total? 415. Okay, so how many answers? The winner got how many answers right? Yeah, wait. Or do you know yet? <laughs> I have one at 14. One, two, 14 out of 20, not bad. It's past passing grade, maybe. <laughs> I have one at 15. Oh. Okay. I have one at 13. I have one at 12, 10, not, and it goes down from there. So, 15. so I will say, if anyone believes they have 15 or more, Tell me now. <laughs> Otherwise, Forever I have who I think the are. But like if somebody does have a red that I went by my answers, but since these are all within one or two, um, I have Chris Yates as the winner. Hey, Chris, um, there you go. But I will say it is so, um, was this successful? My God, <laughs> what neck? Not even close, not even like, oh my goodness. Um, so I'll say no, but um, if anyone thinks that they have 15 um, or more, please either, and got in at the time. There's several people who have emailed me since then, but. You can and maybe, stop sharing your screen if you want to. Oh, no, okay. no, Jerry, people are saying on page 75, was it? Let me look it up. There is somebody that says on page 75 in the Courage Wears a Crimson po Coat poem that the third line, Knowledge Don's A, dress of note, that the A is red. And I've got the fourth edition right here. It's not red. It's brown the same as the rest of the words. So the question is, is does anybody have an edition of the Thrill of the Chase where the A is red? Because I have not seen that before. So good job, Chris Yates. Um, yeah. Yeah, you'll get a... You are the proud winner of, what is it? Not a million dollars. What is it? <laughs> a Forest Fan Poker Chip. So this chip right here, email me, or actually email Capro your address, and we'll ship it out to you. And you know what? They may have hit send, but it, like, hangs up on the other side. So there's one, two, three, four right. more people. And I will go through those emails. And if you do have 15 or more, we will talk. I will make sure. Um <laughs> Yes, I will say, someone said, uh, Joel Lewicki said, no, this is not successful. The laughs alone, and I'm sorry, I didn't get a workout today, and my stomach muscles got a workout from the amount of laughter. I I don't know. I don't know if we're going to do this again. Mike and I will have to talk. Oh, my gosh, I have more coming in. You're going to um, get them all weekend. Somebody's going to watch this video next week and be like, here's the answers. What did I win? <laughs> okay, I will. I will right now. I will go through all of these because it is a big deal. I mean, the poker chip. If you were not at World Series event, is a big deal. So I will make sure to go through all of these. And for the <laughs> for the four hours I spent today, and then the hour and a half I cannot get back in life. What was question one again? Question one was what was the annual salary for Forrest Fenn in his retirement, which was twelve thousand dollars a year. Yeah, check one eighteen. Oh, question 11. I'm sorry. Not question one. What was question 11? 11. Um, hold on. I'm looking. Find the page. This passage has a riddle. Me pops was resting his bones at the side of the white puffy thing chilling. Oh, <laughs> somebody said this picture of him on the car. Would that count? In other words, that oh, was their no. answer. <laughs> that, that the tire is the white puffy thing. So, hey, yeah, it's all you, Capro. You figure out who won. <laughs> oh, uh, I, won't, <laughs> I won't say it was fun. It was just, you know what? You know, like the other day, and Mike, I think I didn't even want to talk to you because I was having such a bad day. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, my day is so bad. And at the end of it, I just started laughing. My kids are like, this was the worst day ever. Why are you laughing? Sometimes yeah. you just have to laugh because of the hot mess you're in. That's and so true. this is, I mean, could it, 
I do have to say, could it have gone any worse? This was like the chat room was like given up, wrong questions. People think they've won. Emails came in after they said they emailed it in time. The problem is it's kind of subjective. You know, you have one thing in your mind when you write the question, but somebody else is like, well, this fits. And then that's the question is, does it fit or not? So, you know. Hey, it's oh for fun, God. everybody. We're going to do oh it again. God. We'll just figure out. Oh, no. Oh, no. We may, oh, Mike may <laughs> I will do, it do again. one. I will do one with some questions. They might be harder. They might be easier. You never know. Uh, but, okay. Uh, yeah. I don't know when, but we will do it again. I like the concept of Forrest Fenn trivia. That part's fun. I think we need to make yes. a Forrest Fenn trivial pursuit. Who said that recently? Oh. Somebody oh was talking God. about that. How could you figure those questions out? That take forever. Yeah, it's like when he could ask a question like the two hundred footer. Well, was that when he answered it in twenty fifteen, nah. or when he answered it in, or when he answered it to me versus it? Yeah, I'm not going there at all. So, um, I will double check everybody that has emailed me. I will double check it. I will get back to you. Let me know if you think you had more. Oh, I'm getting lots and lots <laughs> of emails. Wait till you wake up I, tomorrow. Hey Mike, um, you were gonna go play poker. I think I'll forward all these to you ah, because nice. I have a I have a sick child. That was the reason I had to pop out. She's doing okay, but between a sick child and poker, you need to get to the community for. <laughs> uh-huh. I'm just. Kidding. I will. I will. I've got to get the grand adventure puzzles done. That's what I've got to do. So. I know. Can you get those four done? Four coins that are up for grabs and a map on the thro- on the too far to walk. So yeah, and Jerry Stone. I think this is actually a really good. Um, reference to i knew of one or two aberrations or differences between the the different uh versions i didn't realize that there's lettering that's different that sort of thing so yeah yeah, so that's that's interesting so i went with the eighth eighth edition which is around here my son's like no it just disappeared i'm like how did the first edition of the thrill of the chase which is probably going for big money nowadays i wonder if that has the red a in it because the picture they sent me does have a red a so you might want to I don't know if you want to mark that right for them or not. I'll send I will you the, send. I think they sent you the picture too. I'm not sure. Tab, okay. send it to Capro. So too, here, here's the thing. If you would please, if you think you have 15 or more, please send me an email and describing okay. why you think you have 15 or more right now. I think the only one's Chris Yates. There is one other that is very close at 14. If you do think you have that many or more, just just email me. We'll make it right. Don't yeah, worry. Somebody um, just emailed you. So Oh, no. One did not email me. I have at least five okay. emails of different people. So somebody people. says in the 10th edition, there is a red letter A. And this is a different person. So I would give them the, I'd give them that. Uh, if they uh-huh. guess this page number, I would give it to them because it is there. They're showing me. Forrest so Fenn, if you're watching, I'm What's pissed at you, buddy. I am letter. not happy. Know that there is different versions of this book. I know one person, and I know her quite well, who has all the versions of the book. I so want to say I'm, that's a clue now. Why is there a red A in some books and not others? Why are there <laughs> different? Why? So when he says TTOTC and it was in, inadvertent clues, why are there different? Why is there anything different between the different versions? It's an aberration so, that lives out on the edge. What's okay, aberration so. start with? The letter A. <laughs> no, but if it's unintentional, I know the book process. Yeah, I right. am wondering what you were up to. He's mischievous. Somebody asked um, over on Thor, I will say, here's the most interesting thread that I thought there had been. And everyone is Henri tonight on Thor. Please. Oh, goodness. Henri. Okay, I'm just getting email after email. This <laughs> went terribly wrong. Everyone gets a car. Um, so... What was I going to say? Oh, what is one word that you can describe Forrest Fenn? Tenth if you've edition, met Forrest yeah. Fenn, it's probably not. There's not one word that can describe that person. So, um, mm. yeah, I just saw that. Dave, I <laughs> had it. <laughs> <laughs> if it's in the 10th edition. Well, guess what? There aren't nine editions. There's 10. Is the 10th edition I... the most current one? It must be. So you got to change that. And those people were wrong that said. No. I know. And I <laughs> verified with the bookstore. So what the hell does the K-Pro, bookstore not have? K-Pro gets to regrade all the papers at this point. So we may have a different winner, Chris Yates. I don't know yet. Maybe we have no. to go live tomorrow. No, you know what? Oh. We're giving Chris Yates one because okay. of instructor error. But if there's someone else that also gets one, um, when did you hear from? Oh, um, when, <laughs> when did you hear three? from FF last? Oh, wait, I got an email. No, it's not uh, from Forrest then. Oh, well. <laughs> All right. Sorry. I haven't um, heard from yeah, Forrest but... in a long, long time. Nobody. But then again, I don't email him. So there you go. 
Yeah. You don't want no comment? All right, no comment. All the additions yeah, are Yeah, I mean, it, that's what's causing... Oh, of I the see what you did there, Christopher Robin. Yeah. They're all red, R-E-A-D. Get it? All right. Curious minds want to know. Red and red? Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, I got... There is I got eight edition. right. Okay. What? I don't know. How many okay, I got eight. There? Okay, so Jerry Stone, if you've got eight right, that even though... Uh, just from hollering the answers, everybody <laughs> should have gotten eight right. Right. Just from hollering the answers. So... Um, yeah, maybe TTOTC wasn't the way to start, even though if I would have asked some of the other questions, like 200 footer, there's like 15 different answers to that. So I don't know. We tried. We're trying different things. And actually some people and most of you have been really good about it. And I will say we'll make it right if you're close or uh, we'll, we'll figure it out. Chris, you're definitely getting a poker chip. But if there's someone else, I will figure all of it out. You guys are definitely emailing me. Um, this was just some fun to try to make it um, fun and funny for everyone. And I will say for that 30 minutes, um, Mike was just sitting there like doing stuff and I was crying. So I want to thank everyone. I, it was yeah, yeah. will email you if you won a poker chip to get your address uh, to send it to. So good times. I don't know how I'm going to send okay. one poker chip in the mail. Maybe it'd probably fit in a regular envelope, huh? So, all right. Yes, we'll it would. And Laura, there was four or five people that had sent me. I have a different question for you, not related to trivia. I, I just have not been able to get to them. I'm sorry. Um, I have been inundated with the really Hey, um, Joe S. said it was fun, so there you go. I do think it was fun. I think we had a lot of fun. <laughs> Saturday <laughs> night, you know, it's a cheap way to have some fun. Hey. Oh, did you just call me cheap, Mike? Hey, you're a cheap date. That's right. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay, you call me cheap and a date. Okay, <laughs> thanks, Mike. Um, yeah, I don't even know what to say. We're Okay, um, so, well, I don't know. This... this I don't know. I'm ready to scrap it. Mike's ready to try his hand at it. And then maybe everyone can vote. Who was the bigger uh, hot mess, Mike or me, at the end of this situation? Well, my trivia questions are going to be like, what's the 64th letter in the poem? Things like that. Where there's only one answer, but you've really got to, like, you know, figure it out type thing. That sounds super fun, Mike. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't the only it? time it's fun is when you get it wrong. Oh, look, let, uh, this is my water. Yeah. Here you go. <laughs> yeah, the shot game. We can figure that out. All right, yeah, we will have that. Forest Fen Trivia again. I don't know when. In a week, maybe next weekend. I don't know. Maybe next Saturday night we'll do it again. Whenever Forest Mike Fen. can get up. Mike, you need to get work on the crossword puzzles. Mike, you have yeah, a few more things to get up on eBay. Puzzles. Mike, do you have any maps that are backlogged or any other orders that are? Hey, Mike. I do yeah. have two. Somebody just emailed me and said on the website, it says too far to walk maps coming soon. They're like, I didn't know you had them. So I definitely need to change that. Yes, we do have the official too far to walk maps for sale for $105. If anybody. Um, okay. <clears throat> yeah, go ahead. I was just going to say, this is really important. Zoza Rocks, um, SNL. I don't <laughs> think it's a new one because Mike actually looked that up yeah, before he was considering like poker. SNL. It's not a new one, but it is a repeat. So if you haven't seen it, you know, it's new to you. So, but uh, I'm surprised nobody asked, can they just buy a poker chip? Well, you can't buy one. We've only got some left. But if you spend $150 on the website, we're going to give you the nickel-plated 2019 coin and a poker chip. So you get both. But we're going to do yeah, trivia yeah. again. There's free ways. To That's get actually what I think would be the funnest to give out for all these different contests and stuff, because it's not a huge ticket item, but it's enough that it makes it fun because I think somebody sold it for 20 or 40 bucks, um, not 400, but still for, for the amount of trivia that we did for the 20 <laughs> minutes. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> you guys should all get one just for participating. I'm in just this surprised disaster. I have a fourth edition of the book. So you see how far back I go. I didn't realize this was fourth edition, but this is the first copy I ever got. I had so my copy. I'm keeping so second, four, seventh, and eighth. Second and edition? I should have, yeah. Wow. And I gave that out for actually, it was one of the very first Thor uh, contests. I gave it out. Does so, anybody have a first edition Thrill mm -hmm. Chase book? You have one? Mm -hmm. That'd be pretty Jamie cool. Jordan. No, I don't have it. Oh, she does. Uh, okay. Yeah. Jamie oh, Jordan yeah. has. Forrest put it in the raffle or somebody else. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. pretty awesome. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. And there's some people that have analyzed. I actually did a shout out because I was trying to get all, when I was collecting them, I was trying to get all the versions to see what the differences were because obviously that has to be intentional, right? Um, so, and oh, wow. I got, there is two people that I know of that have all of the versions of the books. All 11 so, books or whatever edition we're up to, they have all of them? Oh, well, I thought we cool were too. at nine, but obviously I'm Somebody just wrong. said 11th, so I don't know. I, well, okay. 
Um, Mike likes expensive date strip club. Oh, okay. Just playing around. Okay, Eric. <laughs> You're just, yeah, okay. This, so this has been if I go to the Bellagio, the Bellagio on the strip to play poker, should I vlog it? Should I actually do a vlog? I don't know. Would anybody watch You're, a poker type vlog? I don't so, know. Mike, Mike, you're cheating on Bally's. You're cheating ah, on them. I do like Bally's. They were good to you. Those, those dealers, I won't cheat on them. When I go to <laughs> Vegas, I right. go to Bally's and I love the dealers. They put up with us. Um, yeah, that 8 p.m. tournament in 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> maybe but i believe yeah, i just want to try something different and play a little bit yeah but you like games. cash games i yeah. like tournaments so even though i get knocked out and it's probably more money for me otherwise i just like the bigger stakes stuff even though one i know i we've had this debate so right, yeah right, right. so and it, hey i want to ask is anybody in the chat room considering playing at the world series of poker not the world series of fen the world series of poker the real if you world are, series yeah yeah, if you are, shoot me an email because I have some interest and I never played. And like Mike's a big time poker player, but like I mm, used to I don't be. Know. I haven't played recently. That's why I want to get back out. That's why I like tonight. This weekend, I don't have the boys. We decided to do this at the last minute, but you know, it's, yeah, you have all this cash in your pocket from boots on the ground clothing. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think about that. It's kind of a free roll, isn't it? So it's only eight p.m. I mean, I could go out at two in the morning for Las Vegas, and it's still crowded. So we'll see. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, everybody. Don't cheat on us. I'm not cheating. It's Mike that's cheating. Mike's a cheater. I'm not a cheater. I'm not cheating. <laughs> nice. Bally's is my only place. They, that's where, unless we could get a different sponsor for the World Series of Fen and they like put some money in the pot, then I mean, I guess for the highest bidder, <laughs> we. Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> what are we talking about? No, I don't know. Oh. Don't the world next year's World Series of Fen. There's a lot of things we could do for next year. I yeah, and yeah. we have some things in mind. So, mm -hmm. ooh, counting cards. Some people count cards. Some people are reading. Fa oh, man, you have a whole group of people around you that okay. So, anyway, if you're thinking about playing at the World Series of Poker, shoot me an email. I'm considering but, but it. But AJ, I'm, they have lower buy-ins. They have a thousand dollar buy-in, yeah. but they also have daily tournaments, which are like two hundred, three hundred bucks. That's what I would probably play the daily tournament. And AJ, they have this really cool one where. Um, if you're a guy, you have to pay in at ten grand, I think. And if you're a woman, you pay a hundred bucks. And really, then they, oh, I didn't yeah, know that. oh okay, that's kind yeah. of yeah. Cool. And because they want it to be women's only, but they can't do that for some reason. I don't know. Um, so I like that one. I I'm thinking, yeah. but I don't want to play against a bunch of other women because the women are they they rule the world. So I don't know. I'm considering. Uh, they have lots uh -oh. of satellite. I think they're up to twenty or twenty one at this point. So yeah. Anyway. You guys right, have been everybody. great. Thank you for your patience as we figure this out. <laughs> Forest Fen Trivia 2 in the books. We'll do three maybe next weekend. We'll see. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Hit like Bye. on the video and subscribe to the channel. We'll be back next week. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Bye. Sorry. <laughs>